Wow, what an amazing thing. I'm here with Mika. Mika. Mika, speed skating champion all the way from Finland here, performing at the Olympics for the whole world to see your incredible gift, your talent, your commitment. What is this like for you? Yeah, it's, uh, it's a nice life. It's, it's nice to do what you, what you are like uh, meant to do. And you can, you can yeah. like, uh, use your talents. So it's amazing. When did you uh, kind of discover like that's you know what you were meant to do? It's not that far ago. I've been skating like 20 years, but only like okay. uh, maybe five years. I've been knowing that this is my thing. So that's a credible commitment, and not only just to having a dream, but a commitment to a dream. Yeah. Because that you were talking a little bit today, and we had the chance to speak together about 135 days training away from your family a year. Tell us about that. What goes into making that kind of a decision? I know that's the that's the most hard hardest part to being a, like a professional athlete. You have to be so much away from your family, and mm -hmm. that's the worst part. But uh, otherwise, it's it's very nice. But of course, you have to make a lot of a uh, lot of like um, put other things away mm. and concentrate to the athlete's life. And it's you you can't you can't like party. You have to sleep yeah. uh, enough, and uh, you have to like eat well and. Uh, all kind of stuff. I think it's pretty interesting because people that will you know, pay attention to this article, you know, people always want to have a big life, they want to be committed to big results, but they're not willing to abandon certain things mm -hmm. to get the, yeah. you know, to get yeah, that. Yeah, there's a lot of sacrifice you have to make if Absolutely. you, you want to achieve something big. So did you set out saying, I want to win a, a, a medal, I want to go to the Olympics, what, what was it for you? Uh, when I was a kid, uh, my dream was to, to be on the Olympics, not, wow. to, not to get a medal or anything. You were living and, your dream! Yeah, and I, I achieved it in, uh, four years ago. I was in Torino okay. Olympic Games, Okay. but then I wasn't like, uh, that good. Mm -hmm. But the, after, after Torino okay. Olympic Games, I, I decided that I want to take a medal from Olympic Games. It was so close this year, it was only 300 hundred of seconds. Wow, so and, you uh, toured the Olympic Games four years ago? Yeah. And then from that place, you said, hey, yeah. I got to take it to another level. Yeah. Oh, man, and that's then, cool. Then, yeah, and that, that was the part when I, when I began to act like a professional athlete. You Before act. that, it was a little bit more like a, like a hobby. Mm -hmm. It took a time, but I, I wasn't committed to wow. it. And after that, I made a decision, and then I have approved uh, uh, very much. That's almost kind of a good little thing for unlocking your big life. It's starting to act like the person you want to be, not the person you you hope to be, but the person you really are committed to be. Yeah. That's a cool thing. Well, so what's next for you? I mean, there's big chapters. I like to think that God's idea is that you can, life just keeps getting better and better, brighter and brighter. What's next yeah. for you? Yeah, there's still a few World Cup competition this year. I'm going okay. to put those. Then I take a little vacation. <laughs> a little vacation. <laughs> I need to yeah. relax a little bit. Then, then, then I think I made a new plans and new, yeah. new, new dreams. I want to still do it bigger than, than only yes. sport and only athlete. But I still have something to do with athletes also. You know, what's it, um, you know, what's some of the things you just enjoy about life? Outside of being a sportsman, outside of being a, an incredible professional athlete, what are some of the things you just enjoy about life? Yeah. I enjoy to be, be with my friends, to go to church. I'm a, I'm a believer. Wow. I, it's a big deal. Yeah. Yeah, God is the hope in my life, and it's like a, it's the basics of all things what I do, and that's that's the that's the thing I, I rejoice, yeah. and there where, where my happiness come from. Incredible. Well, man, it was an absolute honor and privilege to meet you. Yeah, man, you. I'm I'm you know, as a an athlete myself, I'm you know always honored to be in the presence of someone that's made such sacrifices and commitments to a God idea that God put inside of somebody. So. It's really neat to meet you. I really mean that. Yeah, and uh, you helped and inspired so many people today. So it's a privilege. Peace out. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was awesome.